What is up everybody? Welcome back to Case Digital. In today's video, we're going to be answering the question of how to convert a Boolean value to int in Python. So without further ado, let's hop right and start coding. Welcome back to Case Digital. My name is Zach. And like I mentioned, today we're answering that question of how to convert a Boolean to an int in Python. And I've actually tried something new with my screen size. I've actually blown this up. So if you like this a lot better, please leave a comment um, below and just let me know if this, if you like seeing this better um, as a larger font and whatnot. But essentially in this video, I have two, I have two Boolean values that I've set up. I I have should subscribe, which you haven't already, please hit that like and subscribe button so you can learn more about Python and software development. And then I also have another one that just says, hey, is the worst and this equals false. And the goal of this is I'm gonna show you the quick and easy way to essentially convert these to a one or a zero value. Because in Python, Booleans, that's all they represent. The true false flags, they're just flags. Essentially, the true value means one and then the um, false value means zero. And so a lot of times in like when you're doing stuff with like, say you're trying to do something with machine learning or with data and you want this actually just, like you don't want it to show true, this word true or this word false, but you want the actual like one or zero representation, essentially all you have to do is use this really simple and easy built-in Python function called int. And what you just do is you're just gonna say print the, so if I just say print should subscribe, and then I say int of should subscribe, all this is really gonna do is it's gonna, this one is gonna print out this value right there. It's gonna show you what the Boolean representation is. But if I cast this to an int, since I, so, so since generally, Booleans are just represented being either a one or a zero. When I do this int value, it's just gonna easily cast it to what it should be. And so when I run this, you're gonna see um, Python, how to convert, boom the value of true and one. And to show you something really cool that you can use, I think it's this was came out in like um, Python like 3.8 or something like that. And so if you know the exact version of Python that came out with this, please leave them in the comments below. But essentially if you do this, this is really cool. I've been messing with this over the weekend, but uh, essentially you can do an F string and I can say, I wanna say should subscribe and I wanna say equals, just give some room. And this will actually print out the variable name with the actual value. And then I can also do, um, give it some space. I wanna do the int conversion of should subscribe close that up and then we'll take copy this whole thing and then we'll do is the worst just to show you that that equals a zero value and I run this boom just like that this prints out should subscribe equals a true which we know from that which is that part and then right here the int value should subscribe so one and then the same is the worst equals false and then the int value of that is zero so there you have it, folks that's the really simple easy way to convert a boolean value to an int value in python if you have any questions please leave a comment in the comment section below and again if you haven't um subscribed please consider subscribing to this channel because this is where we talk about software development python and just really any other cool uh, any other really cool um, tool or software development tool that I find can be helpful in your programming journey. So until next time, keep on programming.